in a functional component to achieve the life cycle hooks of the functional component we will going to use use effect and let's see how we can use it remember in our app.js that means the app component when we had used class based component we had component date mount so let's see how we can implement the mounting effect mounting life cycle of component functional component using use effect so first you can say react dot use effect or directly you can say use effect and by using that extension i'm able to auto complete all these things but i'm not going to use it because if i can directly show you what this function is then it will be easy to understand i'm going to import this here which is already done next this is a simple function just like we have a use state but this function also going to include an arrow function and this arrow function whatever we define here in this arrow function is going to be triggered on the mount of your component so i'm going to log and i'm going to say app mounted okay let's try here we are refresh this page and first it says app mounted because we just have app mounted we don't have any constructor so we don't have app constructor we don't have any render method we just have this return statement that's good but if you want to show something like if you want to log then you need to use curly braces because remember whenever we want to use javascript we need to use curly braces inside our jsx and here i can say re rendered okay so you can see first we are having re rendered and then we are having app mounted what if i toggle the image you can see it says re rendered image component mounted but app mounted this is a weird thing because we thought that this is only going to trigger when the component mounts it's also triggering when component is updating so how we can make this use effect only going to work on the mounted let's go to the documentation and then it says use effect yes it is doing something but uh, it's also doing unlike component did mount on component did update the function passed in the use effect is fire on the update or on the mounted to achieve this let that means to make this use effect only going to work on the mounted we need to give a second parameter so remember the first parameter is a function this function we have given and the second argument we are going to give as a empty array we will later see what this empty array is useful for but for now making this use effect as only component did mount not component update we are having a second argument of this parent uh, square brackets or angle brackets let's now now try refresh this page so now re-rendered that's okay app mounted that's okay but what if i change you can see now we don't have app mounted because this is only working as component did mount so why not write it here component did mount only this is very important so this is the way we can use use effect for the component mount only now it's time to understand how we can make sure this use effect will also going to work as a component unmount